Good evening, crisp lifers, and welcome to the third and final part of my hula hoop showdown. Two days ago, I reviewed the original flavored hula hoops. Yesterday, I reviewed the salt and vinegar flavored hula hoops. And this evening, I'm looking at the cheese and onion hula hoops. I'm expecting these to be the best hula hoops because I think I'm finding that I have a taste for cheese and onion, sour cream, flavoured cheese, crisps. I like the cheese flavours. Um, but salt and vinegar were quite good yesterday, so it's facing some stiff competition. Let's open the bag and find out who's the winner. A few of the hoops out. Back, back there. Here they are. That's it. Mmm. Mm hmm. Okay. Well. Mmm. Nicely crunchy. A three out of five. The potato's still not great tasting. That's a two out of five. I gave the salt and vinegar flavour a 4 out of 5. This flavour is okay, but it doesn't quite reach the heights of the salt and vinegar. So I'm going to give this a 3 out of 5. Munchability wise, still quite munchable. It's quite a nice flavour. I could eat 3 or 4 packets of these. That's a 4 out of 5. Overall, I will give this a 3 out of 5. Um but it's not quite as good as the salt and vinegar which really excels and therefore we've got the ready salted the cheese and onion and coming in first the salt and vinegar flavored hula hoops <laughs> 